Stephanie and this video is going to be about my review on the unique um, 3D fiber lashes. Um, this is not all new so you guys have probably seen lots and lots of videos on these um, on this miscast. So, um, so yeah. Um, well, I was going to do a first um, impressions video. I did not get to do that because lightning was terrible. Um, I had lots and lots of rainy days. So, um, I got this about a week and a half ago and I've been using it almost every single day. Um, so yeah, um, my first impressions for this, um, this, this unique that it looks like this comes in kind of like an eye sunglass um, case and right there the um this is the um unique moonstruck transplanting gel looks like this And the unique Moonstruck natural fibers. So yeah, um, and it also has this little kind of book with instructions, and it says Moonstruck 3D fiber lashes. Um, they um provide up to 300% increase in thickness, volume to your lashes while still looking completely real and natural. So, um, so yeah, it says you just apply a, um, a thin coat of your own mascara, and after that you apply the transplanting gel, and then you just, um, apply the fibers, and then, um, you seal with, um, transplanting gel again. So yeah, my first impression as I was saying was that um, I was like, whoa, wow, they're like awesome and they look so pretty and this and that and whatever. But the truth is, and I'm going to be completely honest, um, is that um, I was expecting more from this product and I was um, really looking forward to trying it. I was like, oh wow, this mascara, um, I'm probably going to be able to use it every day and not um, put on my falsies on and, you know, so the thing is that this is not that good. Um, I mean, it's good and it's good, like, kind of like on the go if you on the go if you can say because actually it takes time to put this on because you have to put a coat of your mascara let it dry um then you put the transplanting gel that you can't let dry put on the fibers and then put on a coat of the transplanting gel again but the thing is that to get that three three hundred x um increase um you have to probably apply the same step over and over again, probably two or three times. So, um, so yeah, it takes a long time, and um, also the fibers um, come off. They like fall on top of me everywhere, and um, and I'm not really happy with this product. I buy it. But um, it's pretty expensive because I think they're um, like going for like $30, I'm not sure. Um, so yeah, um, this is the um, unique Moonstruck um, 3D Fiber Lashes and like I said that was my opinion. So I am going to show you guys just how to apply it and, um, and how they look okay okay so this is the conceal um, concealer I don't know why I'm thinking concealer because I didn't I'm not even wearing concealer right now um yeah this is the mascara <laughs> this is a mascara that um I'm going to be using the final lash by Maybelline it's just whichever mascara you have 
available. So it's whatever mascara you have available, really. So, um, here goes. Um, So yeah, well, that one dries. I am going to do So yeah, all I have just just in case you're wondering, yes, I have blush. All I have on my face is um what's it called? foundation and and blush that's it and now I'm going to have obviously the mascara so yeah um so have concealer on and this foundation is really 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 good it covers a lot and it's a drugstore one so I'm probably gonna be doing a review on it soon so I need to dry so I'm gonna be right back um once they're once they're dry so I'm back and my my mascara is dry now I'm going to be putting on the transplanting gel which just in case you don't want to um, be looking like me all the time all the time um, on this transplanting gel these small letters well the transplanting gel is a bit bigger than the fibers so as you can see inside it's a big bear so if you don't want to be looking like oh wait hold on because you have to like put the fibers on really really quick just before the transplanting gel dries so um so yeah I'll, all I do is just get the bigger one which is the transplanting gel which goes on first and Okay, so I'm ready to put on the fibers really, really quick just before. Looks like this, as you can see, you see all the fibers there. Okay, fibers are on. a difference because I'm telling you you have to apply the this about two or three times so so yeah I'm gonna let that dry while um I do the other side and then I'll give it another coat Here goes the fibers again on this side. Oh As you can see, I already got one fiber that fell right here. You can see that. So, let me 
get that out of my face. That's what I'm not liking this product. This one um, looks way better than the other one. You can see that it's... Um, so I'm going to um, do this other one again. Second coat on this eyelash. This is my left one. So yeah, um, I like this, I mean, it's not a bad product, but I don't like it takes such a long time in applying the, these fibers. Oh my god, I got a whole bunch on. Oof, I was going to put it on this side. No. Um, so... Now I just go back with the transplanting gel and seal it. I don't know what's going on. I have like a runny nose right now and I didn't have a runny nose. Just up until like right now that I started making this video for you guys. So yeah. Um, this is like the final, um, I just did two quote, quotes of it. It's like the final, how it's looking. I don't know if you guys could see that. So yeah, um, what it looks like, two coats of the unique Moonstrup 3D Fiber Lashes. So, um, this is my review on it, and I did the demo just so you guys could see it also. And, um, if you guys have it and you like it, well, just let me know because, um, well, not everyone is the same, and this is just my opinion. And, um, so, yeah, um, just let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.